영원히 stay g o d and never let go. Hi, so we are going to do another video. This time, um, it's going to be about ATs. Um, I feel like me and a few of my other friends have really just fallen down the rabbit hole for this group. Um, I have to say, when they debuted, I I saw that there was like that they were like a new group that debuted, but I didn't bother to check it out because I really I wasn't interested enough to check it out. Big mistake because I slept a little too long on some quality music. And then other friends of mine, um, Mason and then Shower 360, they both had high praises for AT's first mini album. So I eventually checked it out, listened to the whole thing through, and I was blown away. The songs were so good. It sounded so high quality. Um, it definitely didn't sound like this was a rookie group album. It didn't sound like it was a debut album. It sounded like these boys had been in the business for a hot second and they knew what they was doing. And I was very impressed. The music was freaking fantastic. And then I watched the music videos. So I watched Pirate King. And I I love Pirate King. Pirate King is such a good song. I love the... It's just so intense all the way through. It's very intense. Uh, very dramatic. I love it. I love that, um, like, those, like, woodblock sounds where, like, the the sending woodblock cascade sound that one that was really cool um the choreography as well was really great and then i watched the music video for treasure that was really fantastic as well i really enjoyed treasure so that was about two-ish weeks ago and then they announced the comeback well i saw on twitter beforehand that they was going to come back with another album so i was like okay i'm gonna be ready on the 15th for this new ats and then they released this short performance video for holla holla and i was like "Ooh, this is about to snatch me up and then they released the music video on the 15th for say my name I was so excited. They looked so amazing and the song sounded so good as well. Oh my gosh. They just are not disappointing me. They are some strong rookies. Like they is going to be a force to be reckoned with. They is really strong rookies. So after listening to that album as well, enjoying it, I joined a group order for um the second mini album. Um so I will be getting that eventually. I still want to buy the first one as well because that one is quality. Speaking of the first album, um, Twilight. That song is so good. Son's English part where he sings that Twilight part is so beautiful. He sounds so good. This is how I feel about you. Twilight. It's like Twilight. Yeah. Oh. oh my gosh. It sounded so beautiful. So... I am in the process of debating biases. So um, I've watched a lot of those unhelpful guide videos, ATs in a nutshell videos, moments I think about a lot videos. I've just watched so many different things to get a feel for what I for who I want because I really don't want to watch the um show they had because I I don't have time because too too long. TLDR. I can't do it. But, yeah. So, initially from the first re reactions, I was drawn to Woo Young um, in the Pirate King video when the first chorus beat drops and hits us. He is just standing in the front giving me my life and, like, the faces he makes when he's, when he's dancing just in general. If you look at the live stages, you look at the music videos, Woo Young gives you faces like he is really into them dances and he gives you these like these stank faces these faces he just gives you faces and i am drawn to them faces i'm like uh-oh 
See, I know what these faces mean. These faces is what the rude, cocky dancers do. Kai, he makes all those types of faces. He makes the faces. Kino from Pentagon, he makes the faces. Wu Young, he is making the faces. And those faces is about to be a problem. Because you know what they say about dancers. Most of them is rude as shit. So, I, I don't know. But he is one of my top contenders to be my bias. I think he probably might be. Or I might have to have a shared position. I don't know yet. And then, we have Song Hwa. Um, he... I think he's the visual. He look like the visual. If he's not the visual, he should be the visual. He is so handsome. He got legs for days, honey. He got legs for days. And I I didn't know that he was the oldest member. I thought the leader was the oldest member. Because that's usually how it goes. But he's the oldest member. Um, 98, though. That's, damn. Two years younger than me. Okay. But anyways, he is just real handsome. And he got a really pretty voice as well. And all these, like, videos that he, they did. Like... The videos that I've been watching on YouTube, he has been really sticking out to me personality-wise and visual-wise. I'm just like, oh my gosh, he's so cute. He's so handsome. I really like him. So I'm really feeling Song Hwa. Um, that one, he be making faces too sometimes, low-key, a little bit. And I really like it. Um, especially um, the second part. The second chorus in Say My Name, when they do the little little walk thing, oh, that is so good. And he looks really good with his blonde hair, like, do your thing, Booski, do your thing. And then, Son, Son, <sighs> the mountain boy. Um, Oh my gosh, his personality just screams to me the most, love me. I'm too damn cute for my own good. And I'm just like, boy, you are too damn cute for your own good. He has all these plushies. And I'm just like, boy, are we soulmates? Because I own a lot of plushies too. And he has like the Shiba Inu plushie that he calls Shiba. And I'm just like, oh, it's so cute. He is so cute. Like his personality wise is adorable. I just want to be like protect him or whatever but then on stage he be he be putting it down and i'm 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 like ooh, okay i see you i see you son so like those three are the three that give me the most grief okay they give me the most grief and who knows what the bias situation is gonna be but i'm really impressed with at's i'm happy that they came back at the beginning of this year so that means they have the whole rest of the year to amaze us with something new something fresh and i just hope that they get more attention because they are seriously really talented strong rookies that aren't here playing no games they's here to conquer and to slide and i am here to hop on board hop on the pirate ship and be a fan so Yes, that is what I wanted to talk about today. ATs, I'm becoming kind of trashy for you. And I don't mind it. I'll see y'all on the next video. Bye.